I just, I'm gonna get rid of these. I love salt. He's angry, right? I've never seen him like this. I think he's hiding it as shtick. You know, you are so right, I'm gonna slam this chair. This is his kid's chair and table. Jimmy's like destroying his kid's shit out of anger. H League Clip Factory. Ethan, great move. Shut up, my boy. This is awesome. So Mr. Beast, you guys may know this guy. He's blowing up on TikTok. This Mr. Dude, Beast? Keith, Keith Lee. Oh. You guys know him, must, uh, some of y'all must know him, right? Yeah, yeah I know him. Mm -hmm. So he's been like reviewing small business family restaurants and it's very wholesome content and everybody loves this guy. And so Mr. Beast reached out or left a comment and said, review my chocolate bars. And Keith responded and said, I will review your chocolate bars under these conditions. I don't remember what he said, but Mr. Beast agreed. Now, when I s saw this, I was like, I know those chocolate bars are not good. I mean, they're mid. And that's fine. They're like $2 chocolate bars. But my question was like, I know this guy. He's not going to love it. So I was curious how this was going to go down. And I got to say, Keith kept it real. He gave them mediocre scores. And Mr. Beast gets visibly angry, actually. It's quite, quite good. All right, let's watch this video. Goddamn. So Mr. Beast... I, here it is. Piece of chocolate. Let's try them and rank them one to six. I'm going to be completely honest. Totally not biased because if it sells more, I make more money. I'm going to be honest. And I hope Jimmy is sitting next to me and not getting his feelings hurt. <laughs> Let's do it. We'll start with- Now, once again, I've tried this chocolate. It's as mid as it gets, dude. It's $2 chocolate. How good could it be? But you know Jim, uh, Jimmy's like expecting this guy to kiss the ring like everybody does. With milk chocolate. It's just a milk chocolate bar. <laughs> Compare it to Hershey's, which I know you probably never eat Hershey's because they're terrible. Never met anyone that likes Hershey's. I love that. Compare it to Hershey's, the most hated chocolate in the world. <laughs> compared to Not dog shit. Else. I mean, compared to eating some fucking dog shit off the sidewalk, it was pretty good, right? Ten. Yeah. Compared to that, I'd pick it every time. <laughs> And how would you compare that to one? It's a little too sweet. I live with that. It's not bad. Yeah. It is a lot sweeter than what I would like, though. Seven out. I remember that that it was way too sweet. Mm. Out of ten. I'll take it. Yeah. We're we're still figuring it out. That's a good start. A good start spot. Though. All right. You know what? Seven out of ten isn't even like that's not like that bad. Well, the rating. thing is, in his world, I think if something's really good, it's going to be in the nine range. Mm -hmm. If it's like in the seven world, I think that's like. I'm not really interested in I'm coming back it. here. Jimmy gets visibly upset already. All different flavors. I honestly think he would have given it a lower rating. Like that's a zero, basically. If he wasn't involved. The 7 out of 10 is a zero, is what you're saying? I think it's more like a 6 or a 5. But he's being generous. Let's wrap up. Alright, here, I got it. Here. Alright, this is our crunch bar. He starts throwing his chocolate. Yeah. This is the one you believe in? Yes. It's not crazy, Jamie. No? No. You don't like crunch bars? I do like crunch bars, but... Again, it's too sweet. Let me try this. Maybe these are... People are saying effective. seven's oh good for Oh my god! Me. This tastes good to me. In the chat. I don't know. Every time I've seen one of his, when he really loves something, he's like 9.9, 9.6. Mm. Yeah. He doesn't like it. I mean, he, it's, he's not promoting this chocolate. If you watch this, I'm not going to the store and buying that shit. He's like, it's too sweet. Seven. I'm not buying beast, beast bars. <laughs> Wait, we supposed to be ranking them. I rated the first one, so we going completely off. Oh, well, we going completely off. Of. We're in too deep. I rate this a ten out of ten. I give this an eleven out of ten. Seven point two out of ten. This is amazing. This is better than the milk chocolate. Yeah, for sure. I'm totally not biased. <laughs> it's better than milk chocolate. What do I put this at? I don't feel comfortable throwing either though. Which one here interests you most? Do you like dark chocolate? <laughs> There's some part of me that's like, I'm so used to the. Being all paranoid about sh the dogs getting food off the ground now. That when he threw I that, I keep thinking now? like, well, I hope there's not a dog in there. <laughs> Better pick that up. It's probably barely no uh, cocoa in that chocolate. I bet <laughs> that's true. Chocolate? Yes, I love dark chocolate. Try this bad one. Yeah. This is the same thing, but dark chocolate. What'd you say, Ron? That's my favorite. My cameraman's favorite. This is your favorite? Keep in mind, only five ingredients. 
infinitely healthier for you than the normal thing out there. Also my favorite so far. Okay. Yeah, Rohan got good taste. Okay, hold on. Here's the thing. This, I didn't really this claim is... I don't even think he can make this claim. Like, this might be some violation. That That is not true. It's infinitely healthier for you than the normal thing out there. I don't even know what the... What are you talking about? Infinitely healthier than what? Than anything out there. I would call that uh, <laughs> false advertising. <laughs> like, I don't know what you mean. <laughs> Why? It's, he it's healthier than salad, dude. <laughs> like some, some Papa John's level marketing right there. There's obviously a shit ton of sugar in it. <laughs> So, as I understand it, the more cocoa there is, the healthier it is. Cocoa has a lot of health benefits, actually. Really? Yeah, it's very, very, very healthy. There's been studies huh. um, published about uh, the positive effects of cocoa. So the more, the better. <clears throat> What's this? We got their ingredients? If you scroll down, yeah, maybe it just that it's organic. Organic? It's the bottom. Six simple ingredients. Cane sugar. Cocoa butter. Chocolate liqueur. Milk. Vanilla powder and puffed rice. Okay. Milk. It's another type of milk. I never understood why people advertise candy as healthy. Like, the well, whole point with candy is it's not supposed to be healthy, right? So true, like, dude. Sh sure. A, I feel like that's a uniquely American thing. Yeah, it's, it's very odd. I've never heard that in Sweden. It's like, exactly. This is the healthy chocolate. <laughs> yeah, what the fuck? Also my favorite so far. Okay. Yeah, Rohan got good taste. Here's the thing. I didn't realize you were a dark chocolate guy. Mm -hmm. I'm not a super dark chocolate guy. I do love dark chocolate, but I'm more of a in the middle sweet. I don't like super sweet. Yeah. And the milk chocolate was super sweet for me, but this is perfect sugar level. It is bitter because again, I like dark chocolate. So I get us a 7.8 out of 10. Okay, so I'm starting to understand this, yeah, man. Okay, okay. Higher. I'm starting so to figure this man out. Then, uh, oh, of course. You're gonna like this one, right? You like salt? You, I, I mean, you're the sea salt guy. Salt. I just, I'm gonna get rid of these. I love salt. No, I want the no, no, you just don't you, trust me. You you like you're a dark. He's he's angry, right? Like I'm not. I don't think I'm yeah. reading into it. I've never seen him like this. I think he's hiding it as shtick. Yeah, there's chaos happening. But he's genuinely angry. Chocolate kind of guy. Yes, okay. if, I I can read the room. The room is red. Okay, Jimmy. Not crazy. But it is good. I love that. And when you compare it to Hershey's, not crazy. <laughs> Absolutely. Well, well, of ready. course, when you compare it to Hershey's, obviously there's going to be artisan chocolate that's like infinitely better. Not even artisan. I mean, shit. There's some name brands that are delicious. I agree. I agree. You know, you are so right. I'm going to slam this chair. Hershey's sucks. I give it an eight out of ten. Eight out of ten. That's. I'll take it. You know, I wasn't expecting to get higher than the six. It is a lot better than I was expecting. He's trying to save it. Agreed. I'm happy. Say this is my favorite Nail. one. I'm very happy. The sea salt chocolate. God bless you guys. Have an amazing day. Can I flip Have the table to end it? By the way, this is his kid's chair and table. That's like the lore. And so Jimmy's like destroying his kid's shit out of anger. I got all the feastable chocolates. Let's try them. Pretty wild, eh? <laughs> Very. I don't I'm, know. Why didn't you give him the gluten-free chocolate chip cookies? Dude, that's what we're saying. That's the only one that we actually liked. Those are literally a 10, and I still have one every other day at least. Sam maybe? went and bought like 20 bags of We have of so many shit. bags. They're yeah, so Sam good. Ape we have 12 that. bags. Oh. Jesus. Mr. Beast is stressing. Thought bro was going to lie. So true. Dude, but I feel like he just solidified real street credit by not lying to him. Oh, yeah. I do think that that chocolate, realistically, is more like a five or six at best. Yeah. I agree. I think at the end there, he kind of, he kind of, after like Jimmy got up, he's like, okay, yeah. Fine and eight. I, it's okay. It's better than Hershey's. I like how it goes. It's not crazy. It's <laughs> not crazy. It's yeah. pretty good. So, good job, Keith, bro. <laughs> Kept it real. And we love that. 
Mm hmm Yes, sir. Keeping it real. I remember it being really good. It was mid. It was mid. I'm just gonna be real. It was mid. Fast food, though. What do you want? It's like Mr. Beast chocolate. Or Mr. Yeah, Beast burger. Expect. Would you rather eat a piece of dog shit off the ground <laughs> or some Wendy's? I would. Oh, I would pick Wendy's every time, man. Hundred percent of the time. Damn, ringing endorsement. <laughs> Those Mr. Beast burgers weren't far off from dog shit, though. I will say that. It was that bad. It was. Yeah, the chicken burger was horrible. Well, don't you remember? Or oh, they were like under. They were like pink and like uncooked chicken. And yeah, it was a catastrophe. Kitchen. Yeah, it was right. Inedible garbage. <laughs> it was the worst food experience I've ever had off ordering. Garbage. Stick garbage. The, garbage. Stick to the cookies, dude. I, that's, I've seen the, the least amount wrong. of advertising for the cookies. But. Oh no, the Dar Man. Actually, Clip Factory.